that about how we, we tend to want to um, point towards any one person uh, as responsible for economic development. Uh, now, granted, one middle of, um, of our tax dollars are going to industrial authority, and, and we definitely need to hold them accountable. Um, and that team's put in place to, uh, to, to generate business and promote growth and, um, and, and to expand local businesses at the extent today. Um, but, but I think that there's too much more to that, that we need to, uh, we all need to take a vested interest in economic development. You know, um, I think it was Eric that said a minute ago, you know, it starts with our school system. Um, I think pride in the fact that I serve on the Wiregrass uh, Technical College Foundation Board, and I also serve as a construction advisor for, for their program. We have 90% uh, placement rate in the field um, out of Wiregrass Technical College. So, I feel like that when we talk about economic development, again, it, it's everybody's responsibility. We have to we have to show our neighboring communities and in other areas of the state and the country that um, that we are the place to be. So, um, yeah, that's thank you, Joe. Thank y'all for being here. Thank y'all for having me here. I'm Joey Hall, Mission District Two. Economic development. That, like I said, that is a big word. Uh, we have the industrial authority in place. They've done a fantastic job so far in getting the infrastructure into place. We, uh, a, a recent metropolitan planning organization study showed that we have enough industrial park space here to last us into like 2030. Now we need to concentrate on the up. We need to all work together, not just the industrial authority, not just the county commission, the city councils, everyone in this entire county needs to work together. We need to work with Valhasta State University. 40% of the kids that come into Valhasta State are from Atlanta and out of the region. And as soon as they graduate, they pack their bags. Mom and dad come down with a truck and trailer, they all come home. We need to keep them here. We're going to have to develop things here. The dot com industries, we don't have broadband in this county. That are working toward it, both the city and the county are working toward it, but it's something we need to develop quicker and better. So we need to look at that aspect. Uh, uh, Scotty was talking about the trades. There's a, a program called Bill Georgia. Right now, when one electrician retires or one plumber retires, uh, if, it's, uh, if there's no one coming in behind them, with every five electricians retired, there's only one electrician coming into the pipeline behind them. So we need to look at that aspect. Not everyone needs a college degree. We need people that can work with our infrastructure and, and work on it from that direction. So, uh, I have a